Hi guys, Linda Andrew with the Red Carpet Report. We are downtown LA at the pre-gala NAACP Awards. I mean, we've talked to everyone. Everyone looked amazing in their gowns. Some people sang, some people danced. You're gonna have to come check it out. Congratulations. Hi, nice to meet you. So tell our viewers about your character in the book. BB is a black fairy tale princess with three amazing godmothers who are very much from the real world. And she goes out to look for eight princesses and she finds out they're all her. But, and she's, uh, she's creative and young and empowered. And our goal when we set out to write, create her was to have a, little, a young black character for whom being black was not a problem. Right. Do you know what I mean? Because Absolutely. there are so many, there are plenty of young adult black books, but not many where they're not struggling against their race. Yeah. And we just wanted it to be a celebration. And then to have you know, the, the fairy tale dream be what the focus of the book was. You know? I think that's fantastic. Now, where can our viewers find your book? Amazon.com, BarnesandNoble.com, their local bookstore. Absolutely. So, and on so many of your favorite, actually, African American book selling sites, oh, yeah. we are, we are there. Now, is this your first red carpet in LA? It's my, it's mine. It's not hers. No. Um, in fact, um, I was one of the uh, keynote speakers at the Essence Festival this summer, and this is my. I was been nominated in the adult category for novels. This is my fourth novel and New York Times bestseller. But the first time I got to walk with my daughter, it's, and that is a whole it's other not world. Not first image of words by any stretch, <laughs> but it is mine, and I'm so excited. Yeah. Now, how does it feel? How does it feel to be on the red carpet with all the lights, cameras, action? Oh you my know. gosh, I'm having the time of my life. It's so much fun, you know. And you're like, yes, and, it's, and we're also really excited because Reggie Hudlin is one of my best childhood friends. We were at Harvard together, oh, and Caroline went to Harvard, and so it's such a big year for Reggie, you know, producing these awards, up for Django, fourth black producer ever to be up for Best Picture. So this is just an exciting year for us. We're it's so wonderful. Excited. Now, tell our viewers the name of your book. It's called The Diary of B.B. Bright, Possible Princess. I love it. And now, you're really cute. Wait, I can show you. Oh, I would love to see her. I would love to see her. as pretty as you. Oh, thank you. Oh, can you point to the camera? Can you see her? There she is. The Diary of BB Bright, Possible Princess. It's wonderful. So, so wonderful. It's so good to have like such powerful characters like that. We'll be hearing some news about a movie and the not so distant future about her. I love it. Congratulations. Yay. If you guys love this video, which I know you did, make sure you like and subscribe. Bye, guys.